Hello and welcome to KDN Live 1508. As you can see here, we're gonna go through the latest changes. So, first of all, there's a new file format which will not allow you to load uh, load project files that were saved with newer versions of KDN Live. The clip monitor and project monitor now do not have uh, SDL support anymore. Instead, there is OpenGL support. There is a new UI for color correction effects. Sub set. See here. It is now possible to drag and drop an effect onto the uh, video in the onto the clip into the bin project bin directly. Let's try it with color. And it gets applied automatically to all videos, to all clips in the timeline that use that clip. Although it does seem to be a bit confusing how to see the effect stack for the project bin clip. Reloading the clip will preserve the effect stack. So to see the effect stack you have to deselect the clip and then click on it again. If you click in the timeline it will not be visible anymore but you cannot just click on the clip anymore. You have to click somewhere else and then back to the, to the clip. The clip monitor now has the ability to preview to compare effect. Let's just make some room. Here we go. So now we can see here. How the effects will be pre, uh, how they will look like on the left side. There were some features removed because KDN Live now forces themselves to release every four months, I believe. So there is no more clip generators, which were able to make countdowns, noise, online content search. Huh, online content search. There is no more black magic deck link playback. It is disabled. The stop motion widget has been disabled. KDN Life doesn't check anymore whether clips are on a removable device. And the rotoscaping effect is broken currently. And apparently will freeze in life. All right, so that's for the changes. I look forward to the next release. Hope this video helped. Like it and subscribe. Ciao! Yep, there we go. Crash. Zek fault.